in this session we are going to discuss about kruskal's algorithm uh, this is also used to find the minimum spanning tree uh, this comes under greedy technique prims and kruskal's both comes under greedy technique so here uh, they have given us a graph with the uh, cost that is weighted uh, graph is given over here so first we have to list the edges which is given in this particular graph so we have edges from a to b so a b next a c so i am just going to write the edges along with the uh, cost which is given over here so i am just writing a to b the cost given here is 2 and then a to c the cost is 3 next we have the edge b c with the cost to be 6 next b d with the cost to be 2 c d 4 c e with the cost 3 next d e with the cost 1 d f with cost 3 and e f with cost 5 so i have just written the edges along with the weights or the cost which is given in that particular graph so kruskal is very simple first we have to select the minimum edge so here the minimum edge among here is 1 d e so this is the minimum edge so first i am just going to plot the d and e together with minimum 1 so first we have picked the edge d and e the next minimum weight we have to consider the next minimum weight is a b with 2 and b d with 2 cost so i am just going to draw a and b with weight 2 and next we have bd with a2 so bd with weight 2 we have done so next minimum edges so we have completed with 1 and 2 next we have minimum edge to be 3 ach ceh and dfh so ac we have ac so i am drawing a and c i am connecting a and c with edge 3 next c and e so we have c and e but when we draw a line between the c and e uh, we could form a cycle the same in prims and kruskal's both we should not form any cycle so here we should not draw the line between c and e so i have erased it next the minimum edge is df with 3 so df with 3 that's it so here there is no cycles between the graph and we have visited all the vertexes exactly once and when you count the minimum cost could be 2 plus 5 and it is 11 so thank you